Hey guys, it's Rose Safety along with... Whoa! Okay, great way to start the video. Yeah, we have some uh, storms coming through right now. Anyway, try, try that again. I am joined by... Rescue Emergency Alerts. Cool. East Melbourne WX. <laughs> and today is my 12991's first birthday. I've. I've. Okay. <laughs> it is a. Yep. I've had this 991 for a year already. If severe weather is expected, this test will be postponed until the following day. And th and this guy's birthday, WR120, is going to be, is in eight days, May 28th. He is going to be three years old. Oldest radio in my collection. So yeah, y'all know the drill. Let's get to DXing. It's not really the best time for DXing right now since there's literally no tropos and it's really and the weather conditions aren't the best. Yeah, they just issued it. Wait, what? Yep, KPS five oh. Hey, is KPS broadcasting weather observations right now? Okay, then I was getting KPS. The voice of the National Weather Service. WXJ70. This broadcast comes to you from the National Weather Service office in Melbourne, Florida, on a frequency of 162.55 megahertz. A required weekly test of the new... Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Thanks for countering the video, Zeus. We get it. You want to be in. Until the following day. Yeah, but over in doesn't look that interesting. I mean, heavy rainfall up to three inches in a short period of time. That's the only interesting thing. And bring us the 40 knots. Yeah, it's 26, no surprise. Gusty winds locally 30 to 45 miles per hour. Hey, watch, watch, watch what they're about to play. Movement will be towards the northeast around 20 to 25 miles per hour. Watch what they're about to pull. Coverage and intensity will diminish through. Okay, never mind. Okay, okay, okay. A continued threat for localized flooding of poorly drained areas. Oh yeah, so um right now isn't really the best time for DXing. So we're just gonna go ahead and conclude it here, but Oh, flood advisory. For the following counties. We'll just end it off like this. Orange and Seminole. Flood advisory in effect until 10.45 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time this evening. What? Flooding caused by excessive rainfall is expected. Where? A portion of East Central Florida, including the following counties. Orange and Seminole. When? Until 10.45 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Impact. Uh -oh. Minor flooding. Uh -oh. oh God, no! Water in urban or other areas is occurring or is imminent. Additional details. 21 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Doppler radar indicated heavy rain due to thunderstorms. Minor flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly in the advisory area. Between one and three inches of rain have fallen. Yeah, I keep my 991s. Additional my rainfall room. amounts of one to two inches are expected over the area. This additional rain will result in minor flooding. Some locations that will Alert experience span. flooding include Location Orlando, Sanford, Apopka, Altamonte Springs, Altamonte Springs, Winter Garden, Oviedo, Winter Springs, Winter Park, Castleberry, Maitland, Mary, Longwood, Windermere, Bay Lake, College Park, Lockhart, Pine Hills, Goldenrod, and Azalea Park. 
http colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood turnaround don't drive when encountering flooded roads most of flood deaths occur in vehicles be especially cautious at night when it is harder to recognize the dangers of flooding <laughs> this hazardous weather all right well that's going to conclude it we are joined by Ruskin emergency alerts and, and, uh, fuck, uh, what's the name again? Oh, East Memory WX. I kind of forgot my name. Alright. And let's see if we can get Zeus to end us off with a lightning strike. Well, I guess he's asleep for now. Okay, that was something. Alright, anyway. See y'all in some upcoming alerts that I'll be uploading.